Let's do it. Here we go. And there we are. We're back. Hey there, what's your We're name? We're back. Hi there, my name's Sergey. Sergey. And uh, from, let's see, what studio? From Deathcroft Games. Deathcroft Games. And we're gonna, this game is awesome. I was just checking it out. Uh, what's nice. the name? Uh, the name is Cube Metrics. Cube Metrics. All right, let's. Some volume here. Can we hear it? And. Do a stuff? Yeah, let's do it. Yeah. So, the game is a memoir for me. Oh my god. There, I got it. I got it. No, leave that up all the way. Oh, okay. I'm in control. <laughs> That's scary. So I was okay. playing it on this little device right here just a, a minute ago. Five, yeah. Too small for me, my fat fingers. <laughs> I want I want my phone to be this big right here. Uh, soon, probably. Soon. All right, like the Google, the yeah, yeah, yeah. Is yeah. this also going to be on Android or is it just iOS? It is. We simulated it uh, on developer on iOS and Android. And later we will enter uh, PC market as well. But first we're going to release it on mobile nice. somewhere September, October. So we're very close. The game that you see very close to the soft launch. Oh, nice. Yeah. Very excited. So a few words about it. Uh, this is Minecraft style MMORPGs, which uh, became more and more successful right now on PC market. And we decided to develop something and to bring the same experience uh, to mobile. You mean like Minecraft style, like it's cute? Yeah, it's cute. Okay. It's cute, but uh, certainly we would try to be it, like more attractive, more uh, from the visual side of you. We, we, we can see how it uh, how it goes. Well, the game itself is uh, pretty simple. You choose uh, the races, you choose the classes. Uh, after that, you you hit play. You enter in the game. Yeah. And uh, here there is a huge world. Can I tell a, a few words about the scenario? Yeah, the story go for line? it. We've got yeah. time. You, you're the last one up here before. Uh, the event, so we've got a little bit of time. Uh, okay, so uh, the point is that um, there are, as in usual life, there is uh, an evil and uh, kindness, and they always fight against each other. And okay. uh, in the real world, evil uh, unfortunately won the fight. Uh -huh. uh, won the fight, and uh, um, the good guys they had to find uh, to escape, and they built the, some portal and tra transferred themselves to another dimension. But something went wrong. Okay. during this transformation and uh, uh, another world uh, was not la uh, just a copy of the real one but has been transferred to cubes and to this uh, style uh, of visual assets and, and etc yeah and uh, this world is fragmented to different uh, parts and uh, during gameplay you have to explore lots of them oh and, wow yeah so uh, what you do right now by entering this new world you're trying to build it again from the scratch but um, let's say it's not like uh, it's done in Minecraft, so you do not build by cubes. You, do, uh, you build it another way, just simply put the buildings and other stuff which is already prepared. So here we go in the game on some location. Uh, there are monsters. I'm trying to find other players that should be nearby here. There. So it's real time gameplay, it's real time MMO that we're experiencing. Can you fight that guy? Uh, yes, that's what I'm going to do. Oh, wow. That's so many, it's so easy to play. Like these guys, who, by the way, right now playing from Russia and uh -huh. game servers installed in Europe. So they all know so, who you are, huh? Yeah, yeah. I have a nickname, Sergei, so I made it by purpose. Yes. <laughs> so they will not hurt me that, that badly. So what you can see is, is in real time and uh, what we achieved from performance wise and we are pretty proud of it that you will be able to play on real massive uh, PvP scenarios such as guild vs other guild on some instances and we can hold up to 100 characters fighting simultaneously on your screen and these devices could be like Samsung Galaxy S4 or iPhone 5 or similar. Yeah? Oh, wow. So the performance is really amazing. And we're pretty proud that we were able to achieve that. And uh, we oh, hopefully yeah. you can see right now that it's really fun, not that difficult to play. And uh, believe me, there will be so many different entertaining uh, things in this game 
uh, like all other RPGs, uh, should have like uh, quests, uh, uh, storylines, uh, uh, crafting uh, monsters to kill, uh, mounts, pets to grow, and uh, all of this. Everything okay. will be here. But so, what's the, uh -huh. doing the PvP right now? What's the advantage of that? If they kill you, do they get points or do they get experience? Yeah, exactly, exactly. Lots of experience. The, after that, you can uh, use it in the game. You also collect crafting. You kill monsters. You get resources out of it. And after that, you spend. Uh, for your own purposes, to build your own locations, which will become a part of this new world that you are. And you can build your together. own locations. Yeah. Oh yeah. wow. And people, I, I will show it to you, to you later. Yeah. And okay. people can visit it. Yeah. So it's it's all up to you how how good you are in gameplay, how much resources you collect, so you you can become the be best uh, builder, the best builder, and all of this stuff. So oh, wow. there will be lots of competitions, tournaments, uh, rankings, etc. So it is huge MMORPG that we're developing for more than a year right now and uh, hopefully in a couple of months it will be released. Okay. All right, let's go to where you were talking about. To, uh... Yeah, to, to the... Uh, ah, second. It is on the left. We should use another portal. Ah, they're killing me. I asked them, don't do it. Don't kill! Yeah, the... <laughs> Everybody wants to kill the game designer. Yeah. Uh, I need to find the portal to another, another dimension where my location is. Wait a second. Now, are, is this, yeah, here it can is. people will people be able to play this on PC too, or is it you just going strictly mobile only? Period. Uh, yeah, this is right now still not not the final decision about it. Definitely, we will develop a PC version and release it after mobile. Uh, or simulation fee, but we are not that sure that we will do uh, free-to-play uh, game design there. Ah. So we still consider maybe it will be a uh, freemium model, but it, it, it depends. We, we would like, of course, to have both, right. uh, but we'll see. So I'm building right now the portal and centering the location where I can craft something for uh, myself. So, so this is my fort. Yeah? Oh, this is your fort? Okay. So how, how many people are on your team? Uh, in our team right now, 50 people. On this game, simultaneously working about uh, 15 to 20 people. Oh, wow. Depends on the stage. Right? Um, trying to find a place where I can build something. Internet connection is not that good. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> Okay, I, I'm coming back. Maybe later I will, I will show it. Let, let's, let's come back. Well, we are down in the basement down here. Ah, it's just internet connection lost. Can't do anything. Ah, it's back. There we go. It's back. You got something scary to your left there. Yes, I do. <laughs> Hi there. <laughs> it often happens here? It often happens. They were doing action poses out front here the other day, I was laughing. Mm -hmm. Also, just to show you a bit uh, what can you do, you can improve your character with many ways, oh, many wow. attributes, yeah. Uh, you also can equip yourself and with lots of items, you can upgrade them, etc. You have to, to improve your abilities, can skills. You, can you change what you look like? Uh, Yes, of course. All the items that you will put inside, you will change yourself. Unfortunately, I have similar ones, but you will you will be able to change yourself. So it's all customizable. It's six parts, I mean. Yeah. Uh, what else do we have here to show? Like this, that's all about menu. And uh, uh, yeah, I wanted to show you how you can collect resources. So you destroy some some objects. And here you go, some special energy is coming out of them. And uh, thanks to that, you will be able to craft and to build all the stuff. And then yeah. that stuff just goes back, right? Yeah, yeah. So like that. You will be always busy with something. And uh, even having a couple of minutes um, break of your work or on the way to, to your work, whatever, uh, being in transport uh, jumps, you, you will be able to, to play this game because we are going to provide not only heavy PvP experience where you should be really addicted to the gameplay, but also like a short-term uh, goals, like solve some quests, kill some monsters, get the reward, enjoy it, build So there'll be different fun. ways that you can play at yeah. different times. So yeah. if you have some time, you'll go in and do like a dungeon quest or something. Exactly. 
exactly. We try our best to provide all kind of entertainment and experience and more RPG experience in this game and hopefully deliver one of the most impressive MMORPGs on mobile because wow. as you know there, there are not so many real MMORPGs there, there is not hundreds all. of players on your screen yeah you can see it right now that, and that's so fun yeah at least from my point don't you think so I totally think so yeah guys I asked them do not do not hurt me that much <laughs> of course they're gonna kill you can you believe it they killed me again oh my god oh my god thanks guys <laughs> I guess they're watching me right now. Right? right. They're like, where? There's, it's called stream sniping. <laughs> yeah. So it's not that easy to hide. But, but anyway, again, we we are here demonstrating the performance and the massive game. And they're playing from Russia, right? Yeah. Most, oh, wow. most of them from Russia. There are players from Germany, from Serbia. So all our team is quite international. Wow, that's amazing. Thanks a lot. What, what else can I show you? Uh, in shop you see there is empty. Nothing right. in shop. But We're eventually not there to will sell be. Anything. There, you're not going to sell anything. <laughs> no. Maybe not at this stage. Right. But again, uh, we. Uh, the point is that we uh, we are game developers for 12 years already, and games is really uh, are really our passion. So right. we would like to deliver uh, only the games uh, that we would like to play by ourselves. And believe me, we we enjoy the gameplay right now. Yeah? Right. And um, it's not about monetization first of all for us. It's about deliver fun. With our games, we have been awarded on several conferences, nominated even on Canada with other games. So we're always proud to provide high-quality uh, games, and that's something that we're trying to achieve right now. Hopefully, we will succeed. I think it's gorgeous. And it's awesome. It looks amazing. So, Kadra, uh, the Indie Prize is coming up here pretty soon. Uh, you ready for that? Uh, yes. Yes. I do. Well, we'll check this out. I will play right now with another character, so you will see. Okay, yeah, uh, let's go back and uh, check out another character here. Yeah. Yeah. So that was the uh, ranged Yeah, ranged one. Shooters. We also Archer, have uh, melee. I mean, melee and wizard. Uh, let's play with wizard. I don't know if that's a mohawk or a hat. Yeah, mohawk. He looks alike, you know? Yeah. <laughs> He said he has no face hair. <laughs> yeah. I see all these people walking we around can with fix food. That. If right. you want, we can fix that. Beard? Yeah, yes. yeah why not? So we're going inside. So where are you guys? Uh -huh. A wizard should have a beard anyway. So. <laughs> Whatever you say. Room. Oh, neat. Are you going to have VoIP? Uh, will, will there be voice? Uh, not, not many of it, because it's kind of hard to guess how the voice should sound like in this kind of world. Yeah, so... Uh, no, I mean, will people be able to talk to each other uh, through their devices? Hopefully in the future. It all depends on the performance. We're trying really to achieve some high-level performance on PvP. Okay. So it will be quite uh, bandwidth sensitive and we do not want to take the risk at the beginning. Right. The starting point. But again, this game is very well playable on 3G connection. We already tested it, so um, we will see how it goes. Maybe voicing will be added if we use Wi-Fi connection. Yeah, that would be nice. Proximity, so like if someone's close to you, you yeah. you're yeah. fighting PvP and you can cuss at them. Exactly. <laughs> but we have with, with another game of our company, Pragoria, we have lot, lots of experience with MMORPGs and definitely we will make here lots of uh, interactions and uh, social activities where players right. will together with a team, with a group, with a guild, fight for some, uh, for some purposes, for some goals. I think this will be awesome. I, I, I'm excited to see the quests and stuff as well. Tons and tons of quests. People love to grind, yeah, for yeah, yeah. sure. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for coming on here and showing this off. It's a pleasure. Um, Glad you like it. Yes, and we're gonna we're gonna go off here so that the indie prize can happen, and then we may or may not come back after that's done. 
I am not exactly sure yet. Thank you guys so much for Thank watching. Um, have a great day. Have a great day.